My last trip was a taxi drive before I went overseas for holiday. And uh, because I enjoyed myself, I went home to family. I didn't use my credit card in Malaysia, which is a good point. But when I came back, I want to use my card to, for taxi again. I can't use it because it has been scammed. It takes me three months to get it reversed back. And I have to do a statutory declaration. It's very inconvenient because I have no card to use. I have to wait for my new cards to come. And it's just like uh, hell, really, for me. <laughs> So I'd been through a supermarket using my debit card and about a month later actually I got all these transactions coming up on my bank account from America, uh, someone going through McDonald's, um, some other service stations, transactions and I went to the bank and they, they said their card's been compromised so they had to cancel all my cards, I had to wait for like like about a week to get my new cards again. Um, finally got some of the money back, but it took a while. Um, it was just really inconvenient and, and un un uncertain and unsecure sort of feeling, having uh, your information compromised. Why am I likely to be skinned? RFID credit card details are completely unprotected and at risk of cyber theft. How can a criminal skin my credit card? With today's technology, easily. The RFID chips on credit cards store personal information. What information is stored in the RFID chip? Identity details and credit card numbers. Exactly what criminals are looking for. Using devices known as sniffers, criminals steal the information stored on RFID chips. Sniffers seek out unguarded RFID chips. It's quick, wireless and undetectable. And when your card details fall into the wrong hands? How does SkinGuard protect me? SkinGuard instantly auto-activates when it detects a nearby sniffer. On activation, the LED indicator turns red. SkinGuard is now in full protection mode, creating an electronic field. E-field, which jams and blocks the sniffer's incoming signal. The E-field is impregnable. It forms a 90 millimeter, 360 degree halo of protection. What does SkinGuard protect? All of your credit card details, your personal identity information, and the details stored on driver's licenses, passports, and utility cards. SkinGuard, guarding against the threat of electronic theft. Hey everyone, welcome back to TVSN. My name is Pete. This is probably one of the most important shows that you're going to watch here at TVSN. It's all about your security, your money, and how some pretty serious criminals out there are using your debit and credit cards and skimming them and taking loads and loads of money. There's some new interesting stats, in fact, that we want to share with you. This is from the Australian Payment Network in 2016. Now, 85% of all credit card fraud of the actual card was while it was in the wallet. While it was safely tucked away in your wallet. That's huge. A one in five credit card holders have had a compromised card or some sort of suspicious activity. And one in five of you, get this, your identity gets stolen. Now, that's from the latest report. Now, in this show, just talking about identity, for the first time, we're going to give away two passport wallets for free. OK, so today's deal is a cracker, all right? What's also exciting, we're, we're launching a brand new SkinGuard 3.0, and I reckon a lot of you who've got the original SkinGuard will want to upgrade, because what we've got is a new... Um, area of protection and security um, where this has another chip and it actually throws out 200 dummy card numbers to those skimmers and scammers. Um, what's also going to be exciting about the show, you've never seen this, you've not seen what we've talked about and always we get emails, is people ask us, can you show us how you can just print off cards? People actually pay a lot of money on the internet to buy all the software and we're going to show you how we're going to copy a card today live on the show. Now, if you can copy these cards and you can put a nice little bit of... Because, you know, when you tap and go, no one, no one looks at your name on there, right? You're just at the service station, you're going to pay for the fuel, $80, bang, you go. No one looks at the card, right? That's how they start. So it's a very, very, very important show that you stay tuned to. It's probably the most important for your security, for your bank accounts, 
for your identity. Um, and if you've currently got SkinGuard, we want you to upgrade to the brand new 3.0, which has got some really cool features. So let me give you the deal. It's a cracker. I want to start, though, with the price. Normally, you pay $30, which is... Um, and I think they were actually 40 or 50 bucks on their own, weren't they? 40 bucks on their own when, uh, when we launched the skin guard. So um, they have come down, and that's due to obviously popular demand. However, let's times it by four, which is brilliant. You're getting four of them in the bundle for $89.95. By the way, you can pay it off over two easy payments. $44.98 gets it home. 70703 is your item number. But, and that's one for every wallet in the family, which is brilliant. The other great thing is, I talked about your identity. Now, a lot of you may have travelled internationally over the Christmas season uh, and gone away. If, you've, if you take your passport, and I want to make this very, very clear, if you have a passport that has a chip in it, and all of the brand new passports do, you need to make sure you take your passport wallets with you. And I just want to reiterate that, because if you've got a brand new passport, uh, if you go to the centre page, by the way, we're giving away those two wallets for your passport for free. Uh, right here in the centre page says do not stamp. There is a chip in this page, OK? Now, if, if you don't have your passport in a wallet like this and, and, and you go overseas, the potential is that you may well have your identity stolen. Now, we're giving you two of these today. They're absolutely free. They're valued at $60. We have never done it before. I just think that's another important step in keeping your personal information security safe. And I hate to say this, and I don't want to scare you, but it's almost a matter of not if, but possibly when. You are either going to get skimmed or you're going to have your card stolen, you're going to have them copied. This whole... Great convenience of tap and go is great, but it all, of course, works with technology that is wireless, and that's where these modern criminals are having a field day. Now, the old-fashioned thing that we used to protect was our PIN number, right? You go to the ATM, um, you, you know, dial in your PIN, you, you don't want anyone to see it. Trust me, they've moved on from that. Now, this is a security pack. This is already on the move. It's brand new to us today. It's like a today special offer price, to be honest. Four of the Skin Guards 3.0. We're going to talk about the new improvements at around about 15 minutes or so. Remember, all your outlaying today is $44.98. And you get the two passport wallets valued at $60 for free. And this is an investment. I mean, you insure your car, you insure your home, you insure your health. This is ensuring your bank account, your identity, your card numbers, your hard-earned money. You don't have to go through all the loops. And look, to be honest, if they scam your $20,000 out of your bank account, you'll probably get it back. But trust me, it is stressful. The knock-on effect, having to change all your account numbers, all your direct debits, all your automatic um, subscriptions from all your different providers on your phone. Um, and hopefully you do get your money back. But again, it's, this, it's the... I just get it. For under $90, it's the first time we've given you the four-pack and the two free wallets. It's moving very quickly. We're having a busy weekend. If you're new to TVSN, 132310 is the number in Australia. If you're watching us in NZ, it is 0800 101 301. The gift, unfortunately, we don't have as much to go around. We'll be counting that one down. You'll still get your four cards, don't worry. That's four wallets, that's four purses. Um, but we want to make sure you get that skin guard, um, passport, wallet, absolutely for free. So the best man in Australia to, sh to, to tell us all this, and for the first time he is going to show you how easy it is to literally copy cards for the first time, Mr Pete Samios. Peter. How are you, my friend? Good, good. Hey, um, the stats are, are, are incredible, really, and I know... Um, there was another one I wanted to share, actually, about... Uh, I think it was the... Who's the, che the, the Treasury? The Chief Cashier. The Chief at Cashier the in Bank the of England. Can, can so, you explain this? So, the Chief Cashier at the Bank of England... So, her signature appears on every British note in currency, in circulation, and she does not... She actually said, I do not trust contactless cards. So, what she doesn't trust is tap and go. Okay. Okay? And she said that's a personal opinion, but she will never use tap and go. So I don't think you get anyone 
in a banking institution as high up as that. More qualified. More qualified. And don't forget the Victorian Police Commissioner, the Western Australian Police Commissioner, want tap and go banned because it's taking up much energy and time of the police department in looking after the fraud situations that are occurring in those states. I, I think it would be fair to say it's not just like an epidemic, it's a pandemic. This is something that is out of control. I'm going to recap on these latest statistics. 2018 report, 85% of all credit card fraud um, is happening while the card is not present. Um, one in five credit card holders compromise cards with suspicious activity. There's one in five of us. And one of five Australians have had their identity stolen. Or will have their identity stolen. In the future? Every, no, in a year. In a year. That's every year. OK. okay. So these obviously are big issues. What's going on out there? What's okay. the current state of play? Look, we all love the convenience and the speed of tap and go. We're just so used to it. These days we get frustrated when we're in a queue and someone's taking time to get their card out to tap. That's how much we've become used to it. And also, it's the same technology as an Opal card or a Mickey card. And now it's the same technology as a room key at a hotel or a motel where they tap and go. Mm. So the technology of RFID is growing exponentially. It's not getting less. Mm. So we're just at the threshold, Peter, and it's going to boom. But, of course, the problem is the technology is vulnerable because what RFID does, the way your credit card works, is that it's got a chip in it like the FPOS machine. So when you put it in like that, what will happen is the FPOS machine... Oh, OK, we'll turn that one on and give me a valid... F oh, I've got my dummy cards there, but here's a real card, right? So what will happen is... The chip in the card reads the chip in the reader. They're having a conversation. Your credit card dumps all the information that's programmed into here to receive it. And then, of course, when you're paying for something, it's OK because they're just taking what you legitimately bought. But if you come over here, Peter, I'm going to show you the technology for the first time live in four years in TVSN because a lot of people stop me at the airports and the shopping centres and say, I don't believe all that. Yeah. I'm going, well, you better believe it. I mean, how do you think skimming occurs? C c before we do that, can I yep. just show what happens in shopping centres? And sure. this happens everywhere, and yep. we've all been having a great holiday season. This is skimming, right? This is what this crook is so, doing. So he's got a card reader, which I'm about to show you, in his bag, and it's powered up with a computer in there, and he's literally taken all the credit cards from all the shoppers around him. So there's a surround feel. Now, depending on the power of the skimmer, depending, depends on the distance. And here's your distance signal range chart, Peter. So when it's in a backpack or in a case, it'll be up to two to three metres. If it's in a big backpack, five. If, if you're really close, you can do it on your phone, which we'll show you. But if you've got... Um, carry-on luggage, it can be 10 metres, and now they've got all these wireless antennas with uh, power banks in them, and they're driving up and down streets and getting it. So it's out of control. It's a, it's a, it doesn't matter who you talk to in a bank, it's out of control. They'll, they'll admit. But the problem is, like you said, it's the knock-on effect. You know you'll probably get your money back. It could take two to three months sometimes for large amounts. Mm. But the thing is, you forget about updating your service providers. You know, you forget about the repayments. You forget about your medical insurance. You forget about your household insurance because they're all linked into your credit card and, God forbid, if it was... Um, what's the term they use with the banks? No, no. The term I'm using, what had happened... Hand on the buzzer. No, what had happened if they cancelled your credit card but you didn't update and something happened in the interim? Oh, and you got it. You got, the you got completely it. compromised. Yeah, That's you're right. Toast. You're toast. So these we'll are the situations, toast. right? So it's very important that you're protected 
And basically, the only person, as you always say on these shows, that can protect you is yourself. I'm going to let you... Look, we're going to, for the first time, show you how we're going to copy cars. I've got to update the bundle. Um, actually, can I tell you, we normally get busy like half an hour from now, but already 20% gone. This is a new bundle, guys. Brand new bundle today. And I think the most exciting part about this... OK, we're talking skin guard right now. So that's four wallets, four purses, done, protected with the brand new 3.0. This is what I'm really excited about today. If you have got one of the brand new Australian passports, which is one of the most prized on the planet, it has a chip in it. That's what that centre page says. Do not stamp. You get the two passport wallets for free. So that makes, the, like, the four cards are $30, under $10 each. Please order quickly. This is a... Look, it's not a matter of if, it's probably a matter of when... It happened to our producer. I've had it happen to me. When you get a call from the bank or when you get the text message, have you had, did you do this payment of $2,000? You know, that feeling is like your heart drops, okay? So we don't want that and we can protect you. I'm going to show you now, come over with me. I want to show you for the first time how you can literally go on the internet today and don't do this. Get the fancy software and the hardware and make your own credit cards and debit cards. Pete, we've never shown this. No. Everyone's always asked. They have. And this is brilliant because it's a whole new level of security that now we can feel comfortable about. Tell us about That's it. That's right. So this, this is what we call a skimmer, and so is this here. And what the skimmers do, they collect the information. The guy that walk, was walking through the shopping centre, he collects the information on there. Now, that machine itself, Peter, can't copy a credit card. Mm -hmm. What it does, it collects the information off your credit card. Wirelessly. Wirelessly. It's having the... But then, when you get one of these machines and you get the program, you're now loading it into your program. Now, every credit card has 16 binary codes in it and what it's doing now, it's reading my card. Is that better? Yeah, perfect, mate. Okay, so if you have a look here, that's my old credit card. There so don't worry if you want to copy the numbers yeah. and try and use it, it go working. for it. <laughs> but I've. So what it's doing is it's reading those. Now, just before I show you the next step, the SkimGuard 3.0, have a look at this. You can, can you hear the beeping? Yeah. So okay. okay. So the beeping is basically, it's telling you that it's reading it. No more beeping. See how it's stopped there now? Wow. Look at the screen. It's gone. Gosh. Now it's reading it again. This is how effective SkimGuard 3.0 is and how effective... It's almost bulletproof in a sense of this... It is. The, the, ..the way that we can protect... But see, people want to copy cards, don't they? Yeah. There's another level of skimming here. Now... So what we've done now, we've copied the information onto the computer. This okay? is what the, the bad guys are doing, by so the way. So what we need to do now, I need to go to the next program and show you how they copy them. And this, um, you keep doing that, Pete. This is something, yeah. again, we have not shown you this before at TVSN. By the way, way more than 20% gone. People are getting singles. Um, get the four-pack, guys. the best way to go, OK? Um, we're going to show you how you can literally... Print cards. Now, this is not what we want to happen. No. This is, again, another level. OK. So, remember I said all the credit cards got a 16-digit 16 uh, 16 area? Yep. So, here you can see on the screen, there's nothing on the screen, right? But what we want to do now, we've got the information off that card, right? Now, I'm just going to get a blank card. We're going to pop it on there. And by the way, people can buy this stuff, unfortunately, cheaply. And we're going to read cheaply. it. And there it is. So what we're going to do now, we're reading this credit card onto there. Yep. So, so I'm transferring it. all the information. And the worst thing is, if I want to... It's like a duplicate, right? <laughs> yeah, but it even gets worse. If you want to change any of the information, as in an address or something, you just find the right area and you bring it down here and then you can just delete and put in another number 
and then you can write that and press OK. So this is the level of sophistication. And then, of course, what you do, you go to your printer and you print your credit card numbers front and back. Then you get the card that you wrote it onto. And as you can see on this card, that is my card, this looks exactly like my credit card. So this is the one we copy. Yeah. This is the original, okay? And, and for one side, the one we copied, I left it blank. So you can see I haven't stuck that on. And, of course, the problem with so all that... So you can go and tap and go, right? So this is the thing. We're, we're talking about all the $100 or less charges. That's right. Which no one ever looks and checks whether it's your card, right? No one. That's just where it starts. That's right. So now... There's the card, right, that That's I copied, and it's reading. So now we know that the card we can take to a service station, grocery store, we could take it to take a away. takeaway shopping centre. As long as the payment is under $100, we're in business. So then what you that, do... Can I just say that took less than five minutes? That's right. And you can buy... That pro, you need that program, but if you go to the dark web, which is where all the illegal activity is, that's where you'll find. Now, I'm not even a computer buff, but I have a guy in my office who set it all up for me, and I said, mate, I can't do all that. He was going to come in today to do it. He's on holidays because of Australia Day weekend. He said, no, I'll just set it up so you can do it easily. Bingo. Bingo. Look Look at how inconspicuous these guys are. And remember, there's so many ways now that you can get skimmed. There's so many ways now that the crooks can copy your cards. That's right. And from a range. I mean, they can do it from a distance. They can do it close up. It could be in a backpack or a satchel. At the airports, they love walking around with carry-on luggage. Now... I know, that seems unusual that someone would have carry-on luggage at an airport. Yeah, <laughs> yeah right. Um, but can I also just show you that this is the possibility then, and, 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 and we'll go how it works in a minute, but this is the, the endless amount of cards that then that crook can go ahead and duplicate, yep. OK? Endless and endless and endless cards. All they've got to do, Peter is go and buy these things, and you can buy them on the internet. They're called readable and writable NFC cards. You just buy them anywhere on the internet. I paid one cent each for these. I bought 500 of them. So, in theory, if I wanted to today, on a hot day, I could sit at home, write 500 cards up, put the stickers on them, Throw them to my friends and that you're in business. All right, I've got an update, and then we're going to come back and update you on the brand new exciting updates about a third stock gone, folks. There's, there's, look, again, we're not here to freak you out. We're here to help, help you. I guess probably the really honest thing to say is to just make sure you put this in your wallet, you get four of them. So that's four wallets covered, four purses, um, and again, two passports. You've, you've not seen this deal before, which is why we are just absolutely getting imploded on the phones. I know we are saying try to go easy order, speedy order the web right now. We're live on your Sunday Arvo, just gone uh, 4.45 Eastern Daylight Saving Time. Um, just Again, we'll talk about the passport wallets. I just think this is such a win today because these... You, you think the cards are like gold for the, for the crooks? This is platinum. Like this, if they can copy this... And, g and get a hold of your identity, I tell you what, it's, it's a, if, if you want to go and do your own... Actually, don't do your own research, just trust me. All you do is just pop this in here. <laughs> You've got a place for a few cards there as well, some foreign currency, and, and you're done. You're protected. We're giving you two today at the value of $60, OK? It is only best in, first in best dress with that, so just don't delay. Please make sure you do call us or get through on the internet really, really quickly because that identity theft is out of control. Um, just want to just... I think a lot of people think, hey, I, just got, I, I want two cards. That's great. You don't get the gift. That's going to sell out soon. It's the brand-new Active 3.0, as is the single. It is now limited as well, all right? Um, can I just say also, well done, everybody. You all take that little step to ensure your health, to ensure your car, to ensure your house. Why would you not ensure your identity 
and your bank accounts through your credit and debit cards. It's madness. I mean, look at this. 38% of identity crime um, in Australia goes unreported. Now, the estimated, and every year, we're talking literally a million people suffering um, financial loss resulting from their identity crime. This is not something which you can afford to think, gosh, $90 today is too much. $90 is peanuts compared to the stress, the concern, the worry. The, the, and we, we heard the quotes. I mean, this is something which, this is from the Chief um, Bank of England. I mean, it's amazing. Um, who does not use contactless form of payment um, because of the potential risk. Now, that is extraordinary. And the problem is, Pete, when you get your new credit card, you've got no choice. You're going to get a con contactless card. You can't get a card without a chip anymore. They just don't exist because that's the way of the future. That's the way we're all going. We've got to protect ourselves. Now, we are saying, seeing a lot of people upgrading today, which is great. There is a brand new level of protection today. We're going to talk about that. Um, in just a tick, can we just... Just generally, how does it work normally? Okay. How does it actually work? That Give us that first How does experience. SkimGuard yeah. work? All right, because SkimGuard is electronic protection. It's not a piece of foil. It's not a piece of aluminium. It's not a cage. It's electronic circuitry. So step one, the way it works is that inside it's got receptors. So when a skimmer comes in range, Peter, yep. what happens is it... the it charges the skim guard. Inside, there's no battery in the skim guard. So what happens, it sucks the power from the skimming machine like this, right? And it creates a field. So what we mean by that, I don't know if the camera can see it, but now you can see there's three lights have lit up in the card itself. Mm. And so what it's done, it's actually drawn the power from the machine that's trying to steal your credit cards. And that machine's what people carry in their backpacks, their bags, and they're walking around, you would never know, right? And it all happens wirelessly. That's right. So now, inside here, it's got an amplifier. So what happens, the amplifier actually creates this electronic field around your card. But whatever this was... It's amplified it 100 times. So however strong that is, this is 100 times stronger. So it creates this E-field, and there it is there on, on the screen. OK? So this is something, again, you don't have to be charging it. There's no batteries no, in there. Can't go it's, flat. Um, yeah, absolutely. And, and what it does, it renders them harmless. But, but the 3.0 goes to another level. That's right. The 3.0 now we've included what we call a phantom tag. So the, the original skim guard, which is this one, and if you've got one, you're still fully protected. We're not saying you're not. But now we've added an extra layer of protection because obviously innovation's the key to success and you've got to be well ahead of the crooks. So what it does, it, act, it act, um, adds this tag and what happens is 200 predetermined credit card numbers on here with data. Now, they're all false. They're not genuine credit cards. And what it does, it emits them. So you can see from the card it's very technical. Mm. It's got a phantom chip. It's got inductive coupling. This thing called a perimeter harvest, which is the outside of the card, that's what creates this fantastic E-field and stops skimmers getting into your wallet or your purse and getting all the details and information off your credit card. But, but it's amazing, this new card. Again, with all of that circuitry, all of the chips, all of the technology, I mean, even if it was cut or, you know, damaged or anything like this, it still throws out those That's 200 right. dummy card numbers. That's right. So that, that then already the deal's done. That's right. Because You're covered. a skimmer can only... The maximum amount of cards a skimmer can read... 10 per second. That's a lot. 200 is 20 seconds. Someone's well and truly passed you before mm. 20 seconds is up. But the whole thing with SkimGuard 3.0, it's also got an indicator in it. So now you can see the strength of the E-field. If you have a look so just light. here, yeah. we'll just pop it on here. We might have to go to the overhead for this one. 
Ah, oh, brilliant. Now you can see the lights on there. Those three little lights. Is, there's no battery at all, There's right? no battery, yet look at the lights. So what we've done now, in the card, we've actually put that in there and you can actually see the e-fuel working. So this is the clever technology. So people always say to me, they pull out these alfoil sleeves and say, I've got my card in here. I'm going, mate, just get one of these, put it anywhere in your, in your wallet or your purse because some people have that many cards in their wallets and their purses and they always say, where do I put it? It, mean, doesn't, matter know, it doesn't matter where you put it. Cards you got. No, yeah. you can put it in here, you can put it in here. It doesn't matter where you put it in your wallet or your purse. Just put it in there. Just put it in there and forget about it. You don't even have to worry about it ever again. And now with the new SkimGuard 3.0... I, I think it's great that people are upgrading today because, as you say, there's a new level of security, if you right. like, to, to throw out those 200 dummy card numbers. This is the original. It's brilliant. You're protected. That's Do not right. worry. But if you're upgrading today, you get the extra level of security. And I know a lot of our, uh, people are doing it. Can I do a quick update, Pete? Sure. Do you mind? Hang in there, guys, because half stock's gone. It is extremely popular today. And I think for a very good reason. I think we're about... I mean, a lot of people going back to work on Tuesday. Um, we've got an Australia Day long weekend. You may have travelled over the, the Christmas holiday season and you didn't have these passport wallets. You went overseas, you didn't have them. Guys, you get them free today. They're valued at 60 bucks. That is, I think, one of the... I have to say, this is, I think, one of the best deals we've ever done with SkimGuard. You've got four wallets, OK? Mum and Dad, two kids. Um, if you're upgrading to 3.0, hand your other card on. It still works. It still protects you. Um, this brand new chip that you can see here again is what's going to throw out those 200 dummy card numbers. And again, it's going to just bamboozle. Basically, it's just bamboozle the criminal. It's kind of like, <laughs> yeah, don't come near me, you know? And, and I think that's, I mean, if we, if we can have a laugh about it, um, you know, you're kind of having a bit of a joke on them with that new little feature is a bit of a laugh because it's, it's almost bulletproof in a sense, protection that you're getting. Now, we are now more than half stock gone. I'm looking at the clock. It's five o'clock Eastern Daylight Saving Time. We're live on your Sunday afternoon. And... I've got to give you a chance to grab it. We're going to come back with Pete shortly. We're going to talk more about your security, more about your protection, more about the state of play of your bank accounts right after this. My last trip was a taxi drive before I went overseas for holiday. And uh, because I enjoyed myself, I went home to family. I didn't use my credit card in Malaysia, which is a good point. But when I came back, I want to use my card to, for taxi again. I can't use it because it has been scammed. It takes me three months to get it reversed back and I do do a statutory declaration it's very inconvenient because I have no card to use I have to wait for my new cards to come and it's just like uh, hell really for me <laughs> so I'd been through a supermarket using my debit card and about a month later actually I got all these transactions coming up on my bank account from America uh, someone going through McDonald's um, some other service stations transactions and I went to the bank and they, they said their card's been compromised so they had to cancel all my cards I had to wait for like like about a week to get my new cards again. Um, finally got some of the money back, but it took a while. Um, and it was just really inconvenient and, and un un uncertain and unsecure sort of feeling, having uh, your information compromised. My daughter was at the local shopping centre. She was just um, shopping and purchasing some items. And when she got home, she noticed when she was checking her bank account that $1,400 was skimmed from her accounts. So she was quite in, quite distressed about the whole situation um, because she was very surprised that they were able to get that much money from her account without her even knowing and with her just having her cards just on her without anyone taking it. So, yeah, she was really quite distressed about that whole situation. A lot of people fighting back, fighting the criminals, fighting these fraudsters, getting on top of their security today. Um, another update for you, the single... Oh, actually, the double gone, sold out. So this is, this is what's happening this afternoon, guys. We are, when we say we're busy, we're only telling you this because we don't want you to miss out. We can, this is brand new, the 3.0. We've only been able to get a limited amount of stock from Pete. Um, I've been told by my producer it will sell out today. OK, so this deal, it's four skin cards, 3.0, 60% of them have gone, and we've got less gifts than we do packs. Okay.
This is a bit of a wait on the phones. Just go the, go the automated lines, guys. Go easy order, speedy order. Go the web or use the app. There's no wait, no hold there, no queue. Who wants to wait? I can't bear it. Um, so just go the automated lines and you're through in a flash. And you know what's interesting? And I want to come and talk about the Passport Wallet because you're mm -hmm. getting it for free today. Um, having your, account, your, your accounts compromised, be it your, 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 your you know, payments and, and you had money taken out, let's call it five grand out of your account, and then you go through the process and you go to the bank and you, there's, a, there's a fraud, it's all taken care of, but it takes you three months to get your account and your money back and your account's all sorted. But it gets sorted, right? Uh, pain in the neck, but it gets sorted. Okay, you can get your money back. This is the next thing. It's one of the most prized passports on the planet. These new passports have a chip. Now, I said a moment ago you can get your money back, but I hate to say this, if your identity gets stolen, and it happens a lot, and it's a big money game for these criminals, if your identity gets stolen, there's a possibility, a big possibility, that you cannot get it back. Now, I'm not overstating anything here, I'm just, and I'm going to go to Pete right now. You get two of these, you walk past, you walk through the airport, you're protected. Okay, so let's hey, talk about it. Is that fair? I don't want to freak around out. You can get, you can get your money back out, out from card frauds, 99%, you're all good. But what if you get your identity stolen? Um, don't forget, there's some, some of your identity on the credit cards as well, so that's just something else you need to think about. But regarding passports, Peter, I've got some statistics, and you can download these today if you go to the Australian Border Force website. Um, on the, from the 4th to the 6th of January this year, 2019, we saw 465,000 people pass through immigration and we've had 2.4 million people during the Christmas holiday period. Now, that's why skimmers want to sit at airports, OK? They want to sit outside before you go through because you're walking in, you're excited, you're going on your holiday... But, of course, have a look at the NFC reader now. And I'm going to put my passport on it because this is my passport. And I'm just going to move that so you see that that light is red and then we go green. That's right. But once we put it in the skim guard passport holder, bum, bum. it stays red. And, in fact, a really interesting thing came up with Michelle, the floor coordinator, because yes. she went overseas on holidays. Yep. And she forgot to take her skim guard out of her passport and they couldn't read a passport. Yeah, right. it, was in, it was in yeah, there. Yeah, it was but, in there. But, but just a question on identity. Mm -hmm. is, it, is it true that you can have your identity stolen? Well, can you expand on that? What does okay. that mean, Pete? What it means is if you... Can you remember when you filled in your application form for a passport? Long time ago. OK. So whatever's on the form is now at risk. So when you filled it in... It wanted your uh, birth certificate number, yep. your mother's maiden name of the, her family. It wants your Medicare number. Your address. It wants address. So all this information is on your chip. Now, what? when you go to renew your passport, they don't ask you all that information again because they've got it. They just want your updated information. And this is the great thing about the wallet, Peter, how it protects. So you place your passport wallet... Uh, your passport into the wallet and it's fully protected. You can slide a few credit cards in it as well. They're fully protected and it's got a handy pouch there for foreign currency or currency. So that's the really great thing about it. And when you're travelling, use that. In fact, when I travel, I just use that as my actual wallet. Mm. Yeah, just take just that away. Just as a wallet, yeah. take that away. Is, is it true then, and I've read the reports that people then go to, you know, maybe get a, a loan application or get the electricity connected. That's and then right. this is where they stumble across the problem. That's right. So what this is what happens because when you go to get things, sometimes you need a hundred points. So they've got your credit card number, they've got your address, they've got your birth certificate your number made, made, and made. your Medicare. So there's a hundred points there. So when you go to get a loan or that and go, oh, sorry, uh, we've knocked you back. And that's why we always say to people, if you've had your credit card compromised because you haven't had a skim guard, 
go and do a credit reference on your on yourself every three months because you'll be surprised how many people have got loans they don't even know about fictitiously by other people and it's what they do is they get the money and then they don't make the repayment and it's your credit rating that's at risk. Okay, that's worst case scenario, but it's happening. I've got an update, Pete. We're going to recap the show that was. We've got 14 minutes left and I've got um, a very... Look, we've actually got a problem, and I want to be really honest. The, the phones, I just the phones are jammed. Um, we don't want you to hang up. We've got enough stock for the next ten minutes, definitely. All right, I hope. If you order now on the web, the app, Easy Order, Speedy Order, you'll skip all the thirty people that are waiting on the phones right now. And I, I'm sorry you're waiting. I hate to wait as well. If you want to hang up and go the automated lines, you'll probably be quicker. And, and we've got as many, and we can imagine it's a long weekend, we've got as many people in our call centre as we can. Um, obviously, it's a great offer today. Um, the value is brilliant. You get two passport wallets for free that we just uh, mentioned, and then you get four skim guards. If you're new to the show and you're just tuning in, just take this little tip from me, guys. Don't even wait and listen for the next five minutes. Just order. If you know SkimGuard and you've watched the shows and you've now seen the deal, we're now approaching, I think it's three quarters, okay, 80 approaching 80% gone. And that's all the, store, all the stock that we could get. The other thing I want to remind you is this, if you're upgrading, great. You've got that extra chip here, again, that throws out 200 dummy credit card numbers to those thieves. That's brand new to SkimGuard 3.0. We're going to recap, actually, right now with some interesting information about the, stat, the state of play. Now, we call it an epidemic or a pandemic, but if you've got a credit or debit card in your wallet today that you use tap and go and, and all that fabulous, um, easy technology, um, there are people walking around shopping centres, train stations, football stadiums, airports, and they have in their bag, whatever it may well be, a sniffer or a device or an electronic feeder that draws in. Pete, can you explain and recap what these criminals are doing? OK, so what he's dealing, he's stealing all the information out of your wallet or your purse or your phone. And he's basically walking by. It's wireless because your credit card chip wants to have a chat with the chip in his card reader. And... The range depends how far they can skim you from. Well, depends on how strong the skimming device is, Peter. But you don't have to be real flash to get up to five metres away. And then when you're in the airports, you're normally looking at 10 metres and going up and down the streets in vans at 20. So this is, this is why it's a Because there's no way... We love the technology of tap and go. We love the service, the speed, the convenience, but the thieves love it more because there's no way you can have your cake and eat it when it comes to RFID protection. You either got to cut your credit card up and never use it again and just keep your numbers and, and use them when you can or you've got to be protected. You've got to be protected and electronic protection's the best because SkimGuard is so good, there's no batteries required. See, you don't have to download an app. You don't need to recharge. You don't need a battery. It can never fail you, Peter. And now with the new SkimGuard 3.0, not only that, it's throwing out 200 credit card numbers to anyone that wants them. It's, you, you watch the show at home, and I'm sure you're probably sitting there going... Jeez, even if I walk out my front door, I'm vulnerable. Absolutely. You walk out Absolutely. your front door, catch the train. And this is the thing. It's funny, you know, you sort of think, oh, I'll be right. She'll be OK. It won't happen to me. How many people do you know who've had this issue go on? I know I have. My family has. My friends have. I'd be able to count on both hands. You know? Pete, the question is this. Is there anyone out there that knows of no one that's had their credit cards compromised. Mm. Is there anyone there who says, look, at all the people I know, none of them have ever had a problem with their credit card? No one. That's the question. It could be you next, 
And in fact, unfortunately, the statistics, it's not if, it's more likely when. And this is why SkimGuard should be in every purse, every wallet and every passport. Whether you're at home or you travel, it doesn't matter. Keep it in here, wherever you go. And, and just briefly, I want to do two things, Pete. I want to show the demo how you can actually copy cards. Sure. And I want to... And, and, and by the way, um, I'm going to apologise if you miss out. In the next two minutes, if you don't order, you won't be able to get it. I, I, I hate to be the bearer of bad news. Um, we're just literally... My, my, my producer has the computer screen. He's in contact with the call centre. We know exactly what's going on live. And currently, more people on the phones than stop. So... Please go to the web. If you're watching a repeat show, and I would, I hope we'll be able to restock this. If you're watching a repeat show, it's your lucky day. Okay, we've been able to replenish the stock. But right now, I want to just do a very, very quick demonstration. And this is, we, we've always been asked, because we know that we can protect you wirelessly and we're walking through the shops and the, all that sort of stuff. People say, they, but the criminals copy cards. They actually get your card, and then they copy heaps of them. And, of course, when you go and do tap and go, um, and, and that, no one ever checks your card, do they? I mean, no one checks it's yours. So, Pete, show us and okay. educate us how these criminals, and this is a demo of what a criminal would do. That's right. This is my own credit card, and this is a reader and a writer as well. This is more sophisticated than this. So this will read the card, as you can see, take the information off the card. This will take the information off the card, but it will then be able to what we call write it onto a dummy card. So if we have a look on the screen here, I'm going to run a program. Let me put my glasses on. And they on. flog this stuff on the, internet, on the dark web, right? Well, I bought it on the dark web, so there you go. Mm. So, and what we're going to do, what it's doing now, it's reading all the information off the credit card, Okay. Now, remember what I said about SkimGuard 3.0? Have a look what happens when it comes near SkimGuard 3.0. Look at that. Jammed. Jammed. There's nothing there. No beeping, nothing. Take it away. There it is again. That's how effective SkimGuard 3.0 is. Okay. Bingo. I love it. Now, the next step is this. So most criminals can get to that stage. But the sophisticated ones get to this stage, Peter. And you've got to bear with me because I'm not a computer guy. No, mate, you keep going. I just want to just let you know um, it's about to go limited and about to sell out. Please, again, automated lines are compulsory. We thought we had enough. I think because holiday seasons have happened, people have travelled and gone, geez, I would have liked those passport wallets. I didn't have that protection when I travelled. Um, but I'm going away mid-year. Um, you've definitely got it. Um, you've got a... Um, I mean, obviously, when it comes to the lifespan of these, I believe it's five years, Pete, you guys give a guarantee. Yep. Is that right? So you're covered for that as well. Uh, and that's, of course, the skin guard and the passport wallet. So, again, there's no, uh, there's no batteries and there's no recharging. There's nothing like that. Uh, well done if you've got it. I think we've got literally six minutes left of the show. OK. So here we are. Now what we're going to do, we're going to copy that information onto a... A dummy card. So we're going to copy all that information and we're going to read it here. So now, card or a file, which means what we need to do is jam up here again. We're going to go like this. What amazes me is that these guys could just do this literally. They can. With a computer and, a pow and power and that's it. And all you've got to do, and keep going with that, Pete, yep. is you buy these little um, cards and, and, you, and you print off on the front of them because nobody ever checks, right? Nobody ever checks whether... You actually, it's your card when you're doing tap and go. Now, I know we're only talking about payments under $100, but that's where they start. And you can print them off. You can print thousands of them. You can. Thousands and thousands you and thousands print, of them. You can, you can print thousands of them in your... Um, uh, so what I'm going to do now, I'm going to go back here. Ob obviously, again, guys, we're only doing this for the first time live on air. Mm -hmm. um, it is It is a... Uh, high-tech computer program that the cr criminals love. You can. You, we're not uh, endorsing this by any stretch of the imagination. No, we're not. But we wanted to. So, so many people say, "Okay, we, you show us how you can stop them with, you know, the wireless sort of uh, crime." But 
Can they copy cards? The answer is yes. If they get those numbers, they can copy them in a heartbeat. They and, can. And, and unfortunately, they go for, for good money on the internet. You know, you sell, you sell these cards, you sell the information, um, they go for a lot and a lot of money. And on at the end of the day, yep. that's money that you've been able to just hand them over. And you do not want to hand them over any more money. They've got already the card numbers, but to print a thousand of your car, of your credit card, um, easy money for them, unfortunately. Easy money. Um, Pete, we might let yep. your computer have a rest. So what happens now, the information goes here, then you press right, see down the bottom here, right? You click right and all it does, it copies the information. Then all you do, Pete, you just print them, right? Yeah, I went to a printer and got my credit card and then you just stick one off there, take it off, pop it on the blank card, put the reverse one on it and before you know it, the card looks like that and away you go. And you're tapping and going under $100 purchases Any, for the cows come home. That's right. Anything under $100 now because, as you said, when's the last time, viewers, you tapped and goed and someone said to you, excuse me, before you go... Can you show me identity that the card you just tapped and go with? You can, I've often given a tap and go card my to card someone. to staff and go, look, just go up the road, grab, and grab this, grab yeah. this, and they do it. No, have you ever been in a supermarket? Have you ever been in a service station? Have you ever been in a convenience store? Have you ever been anywhere where someone has asked you, can you well, show me your ID to match your credit card? But imagine how many... I mean, just to go and buy cigarettes. What are cigarettes a packet these days? Aren't they $40? Imagine the criminals are printing off these, go and buy cigarettes. Now, that's just one thing, guys. That's just only one thing. But, I, but that's only tap and go. Yeah. Then they sell the information. I know. They sell the information overseas on the dark web, and normally you buy three credit cards for 100 bucks. In fact, we got an email because we've set up a dummy account on the web, and we've had emails coming in, I got three new cards for 100. Without a word of a lie, that's, we have those emails that's coming in. what they go in. for. Um, a lady bought one three years ago, do you reckon it's a good idea for her to upgrade to the 3.0? If you've had one for three years and it's still working fine, but I'd definitely upgrade, get the one with the chip, and give the one you've got to someone needy that could working. use it. Like a friend, a family member. Yeah, but, you know, we're trying to stay innovative and ahead of the crooks. So, you know, like everything else, things upgrade. Well, guys, um, it, it is that chip there that Pete's talking about. And, again, this is going to throw out 200 dummy card numbers. So it's yep. just like a slap in the face to the criminals. It's like, forget it. Um, passport wallet, by the way, guys, two of those for free today. I think that's just gold. If you've got one of the most prized passports on the planet, look after it. If you miss out, I want to... And there's going to be a lot of people that miss out, and I'm so sorry. I, 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 we, did, we tried to warn you. We could only get a few hundred of these packs. If you go to the website now, you might get a chance. Um, check back with us next week, because what will happen on Tuesday, our buying team will be back in here and we'll try to get stock from Pete. I don't know if it's possible. I'm asking him. I'm looking at him. Well, it's your buyer, Peter Williams, that are giving away the free passport wallets. I mean, that's like $60. So that's that's, well, you know what? that's Pete, your department. Pete's, um, Pete's probably having a barbecue this weekend. <laughs> How many Pete's? This Pete, Pete and Pete. Yeah, the, and the three buyer Pete's. Pete. Yeah. What's up with that? Hey? Um, we will, we will endeavour to replenish the stock, and so check back next week. The other thing I will say, and I'm, I'm not a betting man, but I do think there's a few people that will time out and check back in half an hour, and I reckon there'll be a handful. Just refresh the browser, check back with us again. We're under 20 packs. Congratulations. You've got yourself four of the brand new skim guards. You've got two of your passport wallets. You can walk out your front door. You can feel comfortable. You can feel happy that you've... You've done the best possible job to look after your bank accounts. Just showing sold out on that four-pack, by the way. Well done, everybody. Just keep calling back and refreshing that browser. Um, but 30-day money-back guarantee as well. Just a, one thing I wanted to recap on, Pete. Lifespan of it again? Well, we say five years, but that's only because of wear and tear. But unless you bend it or bake... If you put it in an oven at 280 degrees for 30 minutes, it won't work. Just watch and out if with you the nudie... And if you the cut the it... The nudie swims. 
That's right, yes. <laughs> Find somewhere to put it. <laughs> It was always a serious show, but we want to have a bit of fun to finish it off, my friend. Good to have you here at TVS. I tell you what, you never fail to me. You never fail to me. Good on you, Tiger. Hey, take care, everyone. Have a great arbor. See ya. Botanica, the philosophy is simple. Nature is the answer. Their naturopathic remedies will have you feeling vital. So start loving your body the way nature intended with Pharma Botanica Wellbeing. Disney Figurines by Brito at TVSN. Get walking today and improve your health and lifestyle. Walk Slim Treadmill allows you to get active whenever you want. Compact to store and easily adjusted to suit any ability. Take your first step to fitness with Walk Slim at TVSN. My name is Alex Montoya, sharing our handcrafted sterling silver and genuine gemstone jewelry with you since 2014. I'm thrilled to be back with exciting new designs. See you soon. Uh, here we go. Today's special offer, if you love your diamond esque. This is for you. And if you love something a bit personalized, when was the last time we did something like this? I don't know. 414-343, your diamond-esque round drop initial pendant. Now, we've got TBSN on here, but of course, we have the entire alphabet. Um, should be 30... Hang on a second. So this price is going to be really good of it. It should be $39.95. Are you ready? $29.95. Go for it. You might even get enough to do your whole name if you wanted to do it that way. I'll leave that up to you. $29.95, your postage and handling under $7. Now, uh, in sterling silver, first of all, the size of the chain, because I know you want to know straight away, in between 45 and 50 centimeters, you can adjust that. I have the gorgeous Louise with me, and she has got an L. Funny that. <laughs> nice choice, Lulu. Now, you have got... Diamond-esque stones that are set deep within your sterling silver on each individual disc. Because each letter will require a different amount of diamond-esque, you've got anywhere from 8 to 21 single-cut diamond-esque. So the uh, equivalent diamond weight is anywhere from 0 0.04 to 0.11 of a carat equivalent diamond weight. Uh, the pendant itself is a centimetre and a half wide, 15 millimetres, if you like. The bale is 3.2 millimetres. The great thing about that is it's not attached to the chain. So you can remove the chain if you wanted to, sterling silver, and you can put a, a little um, suede strap there if you wanted, a little bit of ribbon, whatever you want to do or use it separately. And remember, the, the chain goes from 45 to 50 centimetres, and total weight, uh, total weight is 3 grams all letters on the move right now now i don't know what time of the day you're watching this uh but can i just say if yours is there grab it for that price just under 30 dollars that is amazing even the tvsm looks pretty darn amazing but the l on you louise doesn't that look spectacular it's a very very flat disc as well everybody very very fine flat disc so it's going to be incredibly comfortable 
on your skin. And the, the sparkle that you're going to see, of course, is going to be from the Diamond Esque. Um, there are your letters. Go for it. Fingers crossed. Hope yours is still there. $29.95, 414 -343. Wonder Wonder Woman. Welcome back. Thank you.